Hello folks, welcome to today's demonstration video of my eShop project. This video is gonna be about the messaging page of our eShop. So without further ado, let's get into this. To access the messaging page, we can use this drop down menu here. So this is the view of our messaging page. On top of this page, we can see our usual header section like this. Then on the bottom, we can see our typical footer section. As you can probably see, this section is showing our recent messages. Under the received tab, we can see our received messages. Inside these circles, we can see profile pictures of senders. Then names of senders. And most recent messages. Then we can see message received date and time here. Under the send tab, we can see messages that were sent by us. These places are showing profile pictures of receivers. Then these places are showing most recent messages sent by us. Then this place is showing send at date and time. Then this section is showing sent and received messages in the conversation format. This input field is here to type the message. Then this button is here to send the message. Alright, so now let's check out the responsiveness of this page to various display resolutions. In this case, we are only focusing on the larger and smaller display resolutions. So this is the view that we are getting on a larger display resolution. Okay, now I am going to decrease the display resolution virtually. Alright, now this is the view that we are getting on a smaller display resolution. As you can see, now it has a more compact structure to fit on that smaller display resolution. So that's all about it, let's get into our code inside of things. As you can probably see, now I am showing codes of our message.php file. To keep our page running in the state, it should be I am linking some other files inside of it. First, as usual, inside of these head tags, I am linking our bootstrap.css file. Then bootstrap icons.css file. Then finally, our own style.css file. Then by the bottom of these body tags, I am linking bootstrap.bundle.js file. Then our own script.js file. Inside of this PHP script, I am including our header part.php file like this. Then by the bottom, inside of this PHP script, I am including our footer section.php file. Then we are adding a linear gradient color scheme to our body section like this. Then 
then we are adding a horizontal line here like this these are codes of our recent messages section These are codes of received tab. Then these are codes of sent tab. Then these are codes of conversation style message showing section. Then these are codes of our message input field. Inside this we included a placeholder like this. Then these are codes of our message sending button. So folks, that's all I have to explain in this video. Stay tuned for the next one. See ya.